you're all on this path, and some of you are almost up here to what we're talking about, and others are still struggling to get there. And this is not all your responsibilities. It's, it's some of the executive committee management of the firm. And that's why I get called into firms a lot of times to come in and work on the management. And then the IT guys have a lot easier. Because normally what I tell them is exactly what you've been telling them. I just have a hundred and some other firms numbers behind them to prove that you're not an anomaly and that what your IT people are telling, what you guys are telling is, is true. In fact, in, in my biggest fear is you get so beat up that you give up on telling them what it really costs and you try to shortcut things uh, and work around it and that's not good either. Any other questions or comments? Yes. Do you have any firms where the IT director or manager <coughs> is a part of the executive committee? Yes. Do you think that's a good idea? I think absolutely it's a great idea. If you can get there. If you can get there. I've written a lot of articles about seat at the table. And all you have to do is, do, how many of you read CIO magazine? Okay. You know, you get those updates. That's what they're talking about is good organizations, the CIO has a seat at the table. The CFO has had a seat at the table for a long time. But in American business or business around the world today, I think technology's gotta be there. And once you're there, you can contribute a lot more than what you perhaps thought you could contribute. Uh, because you see stuff just like the CFO that marketing and sales and um, other people don't see. 